Hi, Todd. This is Michelle. I spoke with you on the phone earlier, and as mentioned, here's just a quick video that's going to go over your website with you, show you how to optimize it to get new leads, as well as go over your overall online performance. So to start, I do have a background with digital marketing, and I can tell you that Google looks at three specific aspects when ranking websites along their Google platform. Number one, and probably the most influential piece for moving websites organically is going to be content. And content is anywhere that actual text shows up on your website. So you got a little information here. Kind of a little scattered. And that's it. So not a ton of content. So let me tell you why content is so important as well as give you an example. So anytime you do a basic Google search for anything specific, Wikipedia is always your number one search result. Why is that? Well, it's because it has so much content. So every few weeks, Google does a sweep of the internet, finds these content rich sites and naturally starts moving them up the rankings. So after doing some competition research of different um, carpet cleaners in your area, people who are ranking at the top of the Google platforms, I'm going to recommend that you have anywhere between 1,000 and 1,500 words of content. This is going to do two things for you, and that's just going to be on your homepage alone. By doing that, you're going to allow yourself to be found by Google. So when they do that soup of the internet, you're going to get some nice organic movement of your website. And number two, you're going to beat out the rankings for content alone um, to all your competition in the area, which is what we really want to go for. With that said, on every additional service that you offer, let's see, we're going to recommend that you have between 750 to 1,000 words of content on every page. And this is for two reasons as well. Number one, we add a ton of content to your site. And what do we know about content? Google loves it, right? So the more content on your site, the easier it's going to be for Google just to move you up the rankings. So the more content, the better. And number two, it's going to allow us to appropriately put keywords into the content on your site, allowing you to rank for specific keywords um, on multiple different levels. Let me show you what I'm talking about. A keyword is anything that people type into this search uh, Google search bar. So carpet cleaning hickory and C is going to be a good one for you if you're not already ranking for it. So that would be a good one to put on your carpet cleaning page. And in doing so, um, once you have um, different um, keywords for all the different services you offer, ranking on all those different pages, that allows Google to point back to your site on multiple different avenues. Next, I'm going to take you here to Arifs, and it's just going to give me a breakdown of how you're doing on the internet today. And the first thing we see here is that you're only getting about two people coming to your website every month, so not a lot of traffic. Part of that is from the keywords that we're ranking for. So if you look here, Carpet Cleaning Hickory and C, you are ranking for that one, but you're at position number 15. So you're in the middle of page two. And what do we know about the, this day and age? is that most people don't dig or search much beyond what they type into that search bar. When they do a Google search, they want to know who's the best, who's the highest rated. Those are usually the people that get their business. So having our business page show up on page one of Google is going to be crucial to getting you seen and exposed to more people. So I recommend adding more content and keywords to your website that's going to boost this number up and boost the amount of traffic you have coming back to your website. Next, I want to direct your, direct your attention to this UR and DR number. UR is directly related to citations. And a citation, I'll we'll take you back here to this Google search. This GMB or the Google map is the first thing that pops up. From the get-go, these top three people on this Google map are going to get the most business based on visibility alone which is what every small business owner wants, right? We want our information to be in front of and exposed to as many people as possible. So how do we secure a top spot here? It's gonna be through citations, and the citation is anywhere that your business's name, address, and phone number show up in some sort of online directory. So think Yelp or Yellow Pages. 
getting our um, get the more of those that you're going to get, the higher up this ranking you're going to go. So in doing that, you're going to also drive this UR number up. And I'm going to tell you kind of why that's important here in just a second. Next, I want to take you to this DR, which is directly related to backlinks and referring domains. So a backlink is anywhere that your business's website is linkable and clickable on another business's website. Think Angie's List or HomeAdvisor.com. Having a good referring domain host your backlink that has a lot of traffic and is trusted by Google. It's going to actually throw a lot of that influence from their site back to ours. And the more influence we have pointing back to our website, the higher this DR number goes. When both of these numbers are climbing, and this number is pretty big as well, and that's going to result in a lot of traffic coming to your website. And again, getting you exposed and visible to more people is going to be able to get you more clients in the door. Well, I hope you found this information helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. If it's not too much trouble, send me a quick email. Tell me your thoughts about this video. I would greatly appreciate it. But for now, that's all I have. Have a wonderful rest of your day, and I'll be in touch soon. Bye-bye.